we are doing something a little different. We're doing a nice, fun one-shot called The Smoky Bandits, A Star Wars Story. <laughs> I thought we were going to do like a, a pun on it, like the, I don't know, the smoggy... Oh, no, don't worry. I've got some names. I've got some names. Oh, he's got some names. Okay. So, uh, this is during our old, a little bit uh, after our old Republic game that's currently going on. So, a little bit of events have already passed that we have not played yet. So, I'm, I'm going to try to keep spoilers from that story out. So, we randomized who plays what. Yep. I'm, I'm the only smuggler, and we have two heroes. <laughs> You're um, all heroes. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, Everyone's a hero in their own way. So it's just like Captain. I'm Cameron. a droid thief. That's just what I rolled. So yeah, I did. I would never have played this otherwise. Which is do you have a name that you want? I to don't. Buy? So what I'm doing now is I'm taking recommendations on <laughs> who, what, and how I'm playing this character. So am I going to be another gonk droid, or am I going to do something different? <laughs> like, what's another laughably useless type of droid? Oh, hold on. In the Star Wars. Now, uh, once you play a droid that accidentally memory wipes itself every odd hour. Uh, so memory loss. <laughs> I have a RAM leak. <laughs> <laughs> it's because you. It's because you study so hard and you do those cram sessions, so it has to leak out eventually. Touche. Memory dump. Yeah. Touche. Yeah. <laughs> like uh, I said, cram sessions are so the RAM. Hold on, hold on. Memory. Uh, let's Google um, like Gumpy Doofy. I mean, there's mouse droids. Mouse droids. Is that the? That's, that's yep. <laughs> I'm gonna be a villain mouse droid who loses his memory every odd hour. <laughs> I probably never got RAM. I'm so small. Like yeah, <laughs> it's probably just all the hard drive. Uh, okay. Now oh, let's uh let's uh, also brainstorm at least one or two more options, and yeah. then I'll, I'll land on one. So uh, I'm gonna Google stupid. While you're looking at a list, we can kind of introduce I'm everybody Google else. Stupid. <laughs> All right. So let's while we're waiting on some other choices, what what's your character? Oh, all right. So my, I got from the random roll a uh, human commando. <clears throat> the only do, human. I, I do apologize. I am really basic. My stats are really basic. Everybody's stats are pretty really basic. <laughs> you're level ones essentially. Except there's no levels in this there's game. There's no levels in the game. But, uh, so, I don't know how to play this character. Like, I'm in Josh's position. Any suggestions? Or any gender criteria going on? I don't... Honestly, it's your character. Male, female, <laughs> trans, whatever. <laughs> ah, true. I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna go with an oldish kind of male with a beard who tells wartime stories of his past experience. Okay, so you're... That word always gets cut off by everybody else who's tired of hearing this shit. Yes, yeah. that. <laughs> like, everybody's heard most of these stories like a hundred times, and they're just like, yeah, And yeah. then finish my story for me. <laughs> yeah, they're like, whatever, old man. So you're probably, like, in your 50s. Yeah. You've seen The Mandalorian, and, I mean, you've probably seen all the wars that have... I see, well, majority of the, Well, I would say all the wars. But all the, the wars that have The occurred. significant ones that's current, yeah. Yeah, like Mandalorian, Jedi Civil War... Uh, probably even the Sith War, which was before the Mandalorian War. So I've probably been a young trooper trying to get my badge that day. <laughs> <laughs> so I just found an article on Gizmodo, 10 Stupid Droids, and there's one Thank comment you know, at the very well. bottom, and it says, what about Gonk? <laughs> All right, so, Jeff, wait, you got the Rodian. Um, yeah, I'm trying to pull up. I'm, Name try I'm, well, I'm trying to find where my download folder is. What are you getting uh, ready for with that loading? practice uh nothing particular but uh yeah you're a rhodian medic so you're the healer of the group what's a rhodian that's the ones like greedo from uh new hope the one that han shot oh, oh the little green dudes with the sucker faces yeah they look like a big fly yeah <sighs> Although they're, I think they're supposed to be more reptilian. Okay. Or, no, I, are I know your character twist, Jeffrey. Greedo shot first. <laughs> so, <laughs> you're, okay, so, your name is Guido. <laughs> oh. That doesn't make any sense <laughs> to the lore. Okay. Does that mean, wait, his name that, is, no, is no, no, no. Can I add, can I please add? That probably explains why Greedo missed first, because he was yeah. specified as a medic. Can he I wasn't please, really trained. Can I please add, a, add more to what your suggestion Yeah, but then I have another point. Which is that... He was part of a crime family, and now he's... <laughs> <laughs> so your offspring tried to shoot Han Solo, and he failed. 
Okay, but also check Way this out. Line, check, you're a yeah. medic because what you're actually doing whenever you're healing people is stealing their bodily fluids. <laughs> they don't do that, Josh. That's insane. <laughs> Those species don't do that. So basically, I'm just going to run up to Dan and be like, piss in my mouth. No, <laughs> like you're a mosquito <laughs> man, right? So like whenever you're no, healing no, them, you're... That's not how it works. No, that's not how they are. By the way, he is a doctor, so he just uses the range to just distract the blood. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you don't have to, like, suck it out. You, you have know. a very Franken... <laughs> okay, just how about you have a way. very frankenstein <laughs> approach to healing common wounds? How the hell is he going to approach so, droids? So, like, if he, he gets, like, a cut or something, you're going to be like, Oh, I know how to fix this, and you pull out, like, a piece of metal and a welder. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, are you playing male or female or anything uh, special I need to know? Let's go with female. Okay. Okay, your name is Greedo. <laughs> Do you have, like, a name you, you, you were thinking of? Mm, not particularly. Okay. Weedo? You could be a high medic. Mm. Weedo. Mm. I kind of like that. Mm. So, so how the hell? Yeah, we're okay. going with Weedo. All right. So, so we got Weedo so and no name. Oh, no name. Oh, shoot. Call me Grandpa Max. Grandpa Max. Okay. Grandpa Max. Weedo and Grandpa Max. Okay, so I have a few ideas for my character. Okay. Either I'm going to do a mouse droid... And, like, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> um, so it'd be hard to roleplay a mouse droid. But that's a, on the on the list, because I love him. Um, or... Grandpa Maximus Stargaze. Oh, a sentient forklift. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, know <laughs> what, I know what he's talking about. The T1LB <laughs> units. Like, uh, LB from the Knights of the Old Republic comics. Yeah, I know what you're saying. <laughs> Should we give him, like, a little, like... A, a prize grapple hand. Let's see. I mean, that cl- little claw machine grapple. <laughs> I mean, he's got to have like a. He's got to be able to steal though, because it's a thief. So you. Gotta- yeah, just like trying to like maneuver the claw into the pockets. <laughs> it's like a claw machine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> go with that. <laughs> you have like a little arm that goes down trying to grab. It to be really delicate. <laughs> this is stupid. How do I play this? <laughs> yeah, we're doing this. Josh, you got this. You have to send me a picture. I'm playing an old okay. senile man. <laughs> Is this a I don't have one. I can't. Droid? There's not one I can find that has the claw thing. But Are just you some... about this guy. No. Cause that's dumb. <laughs> no, no, no. No. Oh, no. dang. Trust me, it's, it'll be so much cooler. Oh dang. It'll be cool, but still dumb. But <laughs> still so dumb. At least it'll be fun. To me, cool and dumb sounds fun. Is there a way I can just... Yeah, I can open the image in a new tab and then send it that way, can I? I think so. I mean, it can't be harder than Donk Joy. He's a walking battery. No, this one will be a little bit easier. Although you don't, loader, hey, loader droids, they don't come with voice modulators, do they? So you won't be able to talk right away. Well, I'm a unique model. You, well, I mean, that you can add one, so. <laughs> the you, captain retrofitted me to be his co-pilot. <laughs> oh, no, he's got a co-pilot. Damn it, this is my backstory. You're his loader droid. You put all the cargo into the ship. Okay, open the image. Open. I don't know if it'll show the way I want it to. Though. Yeah, and we'll let me open it. Or is that just the full image? That's the full image. Yeah. Yep. I can't open it. Like I can't get a full view. Oh. Uh, I can show you from my end. Oh, I got it. Okay, cool. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Big arm butt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> so that's what you're working with. So I guess we're ready now. This is game. Mm-hmm. Is he dead yet? No. I mean, this attack. Oh no, he's not dead. But that attack took forever. Dead you'll dead. you'll like a character that's being introduced, but you'll be upset because he's not on your side. Oh, son of a bitch. All right. So you're hanging out with. Uh, we're gonna start with Josh. So you're ca- hanging out with Captain Roe Barvel. Captain Rogue. Roe Barvel. Roe. Ro, R O. Okay. <laughs> Ro Barvel. Can I call him Robo for short? Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, 
He's the captain of the Smoky Bandits, and he, he's got his second mate, Fritz Seed. <laughs> Fritz Seed. Robo and Fritz Seed. Uh, so you guys are just hanging out on the planet of Rishi. It's this pirate world, world smuggler type world. A world of pirates. Yeah. Okay. And so you're kind of just finishing, you guys just recently finished up a job, and suddenly there's a call. <laughs> Uh, the captain uh, clicks the little button to get the video going, the hologram going, and you see, see before you a human-looking android. He is wearing the mark of the uh, exchange on his uniform, and you can kind of tell he works for the exchange in some way. Um, so my facial recognition <laughs> software doesn't work, so any humanoid I see... I just think they're all the same person. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Captain, it's Captain talking. No, 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 no. Uh, did we ever come up with a name? Oh, for my character? Yeah. No. Um, Bebop. <laughs> Bebop. I like Bebop. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. No, no, no. Bebop. It's fine. This is uh, Asen from The Exchange. He stole my name. I didn't steal it. It's exactly that character. Oh, God. <laughs> I said it wasn't that Oh, one. you said from the exchange. Never mind. Duh. So, Asen says, That's right. Um, I'm calling because I have a job for you. So, there's a, a deal of, uh, that I have set on Rishi that we need to be able to get some stuff brought over to Narshida. And I've heard how good of a crew you have. Question. The captain and first mate, what are they? Uh... Captain is human, first mate is undecided. So I just think humans are the captain. <laughs> That'll work. Okay. <laughs> That's my twist. <laughs> yeah. Because the first mate is some sort of alien. Um, we'll go with Horn. They're like the squid looking Perfect. people. Alright. So. I'm blue over here. <laughs> Uh, so he says, yeah, there's a load of spice that, uh, I need you to pick up for me and bring over to Narshida. Should be an easy run, uh, as long as you don't get caught by any law enforcement. Uh, 80,000 credits. And Ro looks over to you and Fritz. Uh, how's that sound to you guys? Hot damn, that's gonna pay for my retirement. Um, I'm guessing that's Fritz. Uh... Um, screen bop. <laughs> <laughs> That's a yes. <laughs> What's funny is what bebop it, says bebop. Bebop. Yeah. <laughs> That's all he says, and so the captain has to interpret. And I just like clink, 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 <laughs> clink, clink, grab my claws greedily. Clink, clink. <laughs> That's definitely a yes. All right, perfect. Uh, you should be able to meet uh, meet up with a contact there and pick up the spice and make your way. All right. Uh, he hangs up and he says, all right, crew, we got a job. Let's go meet up. And we're going to cut away from you as you guys are making your way to the hang meet up. Meanwhile, law enforcement on Rishi. Uh, what are you guys up to? You guys are kind of just on, like, on guard duty right now. On, you're kind of used to the pirates and scum that are on this planet. But you also try to keep some law enforcement. I guess we would just be on patrol. You know what, Weedo? We haven't seen much action anymore. Back in my day during the Mandalorian War, a lot of gunfire. But latest is everywhere. Oh boy, that was a time. I remember when the laser shot me right in my goddamn face. Yes, Frank, I remember that. I was right with there with you. We know you miss a lot, you rookie. You see my scar? You see my scar? There's Frank, Frank, there. calm down, Frank. Calm down. <laughs> calm down. <laughs> but we, uh, we're we glad to have you on for trouble with us, you rookie. All right, and that's when the uh, captain of the militia walks in and says, All right, boys, we got a job. Heard some word that the exchange is trying to get some spice from here. How the hell do you turn this volume up? I can't even hear him. Oh no, he's actually in the room. Oh. <laughs> he just calls up to this man, like turns his nipple a little bit, like trying to turn the volume up. What do you, what do you think you're doing, boy? 
takes uh, your hat and he start, throws it to the ground. What do you think you're doing, boy? I thought you were a hologram, sir. My apologies. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. He picks up your hat and That's takes a turn of holograms. <laughs> Thank you, Carla. Uh, By the way, you should probably wear an extra shirt there, lad. Oh, he's, he's Scottish now. <laughs> <laughs> Old man Scottish. So, uh... So, as I was saying, the exchange is trying to move some spice from here. We can't allow for that. We can't allow them to get away with that. I And I say it's about time we stop them from getting... What do you say? I'm so biased I think he's right now. Something. I don't know if you should have said something. something. <laughs> you know what? I'm tired of these damn smugglers always get one over on us. It's like they own the fucking cops. I'm with Frank on this, y'all, man. These damn young whippersnappers and their drugs <laughs> sniffing and, and taking and dying. Well, and... we're going to stop them before they even get off world. I heard where they're supposed to meet. And we're Nobody gonna... gets high on our watch. <laughs> and we're going to get to them before they can get off planet. Right to that, so we'll, we'll, we'll get this done. All right, so he sends you the location. This is perfect, guys. This is my last mission before my retirement. <laughs> <laughs> Two days to retirement. <laughs> <laughs> I like the trope, man. Bonus points. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, speaking of, I forgot. We got to do our destiny roll. <laughs> Uh, go ahead and do the Destiny roll. Can you, like, actually be retired? Like, you're already retired, but, like, you were so bored at home that you just kept coming to work. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about how you're... So, so you're, you're, you just hope nobody so notices Frank, that you so are is, is, is Frank Weeboo's partner? I'm, I'm just here. <laughs> what do you got? A light. Alright, so that's one light. Where's the... Where's the little token? One light. Two light. Two light. So who uses Two more lights? lights? Uh, well, yeah, we gotta figure out who. <laughs> I think they have light points because they're cops and I have the light points. Yeah, what oh, I get one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Alright. And in case you guys know it, not that you should. I don't think I'm getting away. <laughs> Alright. So. I might die, so. Well, the, the way I explained it to Dan is really you're both good, it's more of their lawful good and your chaotic good. No, I'm not good. I'm a robot. You were programmed for good. I lack empathy. But do you have sympathy? No, I'm a robot. Because I would argue, I would argue <laughs> that's not bad. <laughs> Robots can feel sorry, they just can't put mm. themselves in our shoes. He just does bad and things sometimes. Sometimes. They can't feel empathy. But I would argue he's more chaotic good than anything. Would I be on track with that for mm. Asen? No, I know B9 think. is evil, but Ace and I'd argue well, is less I think so. Ace and slowly becoming like him now. Oh, okay. You're playing Frank, too. <laughs> so would you think, like, maybe a year after that he'd be more evil? Yeah. Okay. So then, yeah, you're probably I, I think evil. he would start to show his, his true side. Like, I've been trying to play him quiet when yeah. I do play him. Well, like, I have a canonical explanation for my evil. Like, I have no empathy because I'm a robot. I didn't get that patch. Right. Okay. Not Cause Cause I, I, never got, I, I never got the empathy download. I was going to say, because robots Like, if a human Wars, is dying, I'm just, like, poking them. Because I was, was going to say, robots in Star Wars Universe can have empathy. It's just... Yeah, I never got that, that update. Yeah. It's just empathy or sympathy. Don't get those two confused. Empathy is the ability to feel, like... It's probably sympathy. Yeah, it's probably yeah, sympathy. And sympathy is feeling sorry. For it's someone. probably sympathy. I have neither of those. Although R2 could be empathetic. No one R2. Uh, C three PO on the other hand C is sympathy. C C yeah, that, that's the best way to describe. I have none of the above. All right. Anyways, so you both make it at the same time. You guys are just outside when you see uh, Rose crew showing up, and you guys know about Rose. He, he's a he's somebody that you guys go after a lot. Gosh, dang it, Frank! You need to slow the hell down before I have to give you a ticket. <laughs> We're cops. <laughs> That's not how this works. That's not how any of this works. You're supposed to be a good role model to Weebo over here. <laughs> right, I'm going to reach over and just tighten his fucking belt. <laughs> hey now, hey now, hey now. It probably was loose, you know, the old man trope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trying and, to get injured on the job. Anyways, uh, so let's go ahead. You see them going inside, and you see this giant droid going in with them. Uh, so inside. Damn, I bet that droid is fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
So inside, uh, on the smuggler side, you guys meet up with this, you see this uh, Deveroni, and it kind of looks like a devil. It has horns, and it's red skin, and no tail, though. Are we talking about the devil from Futurama? No. But uh, he looks over, and he says, You guys, the ones... Uh, you hear that fella that crawled out of the bull's butt talks? Wait, we walked into a place and we're talking to a devil robot? Uh, no, 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 not <laughs> a robot. A devil robot. hell. A devil is Okay. The, yeah. It's so, an alien race. So the captain would talk to him. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, we're we're here for the the ASIN. Ah, good. Good, good, good. Uh, well, he already sent the payment, so here. And he kicks a little crate over to you guys. It's already on, like, a hover sled. So that way it can be moved easily. I'm going to open it. the crate and sample. Frank! Sample this place. Oh, no, no, no. This is the <laughs> okay. smuggler side. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm me it. now. <laughs> <laughs> Frank, what are you going to do? <laughs> no, but you guys are probably watching this go down kind of like... Why am I Frank? <laughs> yeah. You guys are probably watching this go down through like... What the hell I'm going to do? I'm an old man cop. But yeah, you guys. I'm just there supervising. But yeah, you guys are probably watching through binoculars, watching this go down, so you don't hear anything, but you see what's going down. So you guys are just trying to confirm that this is a deal. So I'm gonna sample the spice, <laughs> and I'm gonna beat boop and stuff, and I'm gonna say like, "This is good shit." Fritz is like, "What do you What do you say, Captain?" <laughs> uh, he said, "This is good shit." <laughs> 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 Although I don't know how he knows. Uh, he said, this is a uh, good shit. <laughs> I don't know how he knows, but we're gonna trust him. And then it's gonna turn out later down the road that this is like some kind of like anti-rust compound that was not actually spice, and then now they know. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, I guess we'll head out then. So you guys start, uh, he looks over at you and he says, Bebop, start loading it onto the ship. <clears throat> uh, okay, so I'm going to try a, uh, uh, a thief. Uh, a steal. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try to get the money off of the devil Roni. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, no, uh, I, you know, I used the wrong word, not st- mug. I am going to use my one claw. He's attempted to, to commit guy. robbery. So he's degree. stand behind the devil Ronian or whatever you said he is. I'm gonna lift him by the shirt with my left hand. And then just like kidney punch him over and over again. <laughs> okay, it went from robbery third degree to robbery first degree. Okay, so go ahead and give me a. Um, buddy, that's a class B felony. Give me a bra- brawl. Give me a brawl check. That's gonna be on your combat oh, okay. side of the sheet. I haven't even looked at the sheet. And I don't know what he's going to defend against. I mean, it's just him being picked up. I mean, so, yeah, you guys see the droid pick up this guy. <laughs> we were almost out of there. Yeah, you see the... We can't just have a fucking transaction. He's got to fucking kitty stab these people. I mean, at this point, you're, you're the captain's used to this. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. I mean, let's be honest. He had to program the thing. True. Although, why he programmed a loader droid to be a thief, who knows? <laughs> okay, so... Uh, oh, oh, it was short staff. Yeah, it's just taking me to a fucking... Red yeah, it, it, it made sure that two jobs were put into one. Is that his messenger? Yeah, yeah. I know that, but like, every time I... I can pull up... Hold on, on. I've I got actually the stats. have PDF in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got the stats. I can just... Mm. It's on my laptop. All right, Frank. Give me a give me a green. Yeah, you know I don't know how to use these Star Wars systems. He's got the two. I got two horseshoes. Two horseshoes. Okay. Two horseshoes. Uh, yep, you're good. So you just start <laughs> wailing into this guy. Kidney punch. Kidney punch. <laughs> uh, eventually he's just like, <clears throat> why <clears throat> are you? <clears throat> Doing this, <clears throat> Aeson will hear about <clears throat> this. <clears throat> Give me the money in beat boops. <laughs> <laughs> beat me, bum, bum, bum. Mm-hmm. 
What? I thought we were watching a deal go down. <laughs> yeah, you guys are just you. You're not getting any of the audio. You're just seeing this from a distance, <laughs> seeing him pick up the Stavronian. I'm guessing by the horn and just going. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that load of droid doing this job for us? I can't even tell anymore. I, I see too much. Frank, we do. Let's move in. Oh lord, I almost tripped on my beard. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, Rip Van Winkle? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, uh, I'll give it a minute. So and how much money do I make? Do I get the whole 80k back? Yeah, you get all, well, no, no, no. That wasn't how much that he got paid for the spice. He got paid a different fee. Uh, he was paid by so, some So, so, so somebody... Paid for the drugs? Yeah, Aeson paid for the drugs, and that and now he's also paying for shipment, which is what he's right. paying you and guys. Right, and then whoever we deliver the drugs to pays us the 80k. That, yeah. So I get paid, and I get the drugs, and I get paid. <laughs> I mean, if you keep right. the drugs, yeah, you get the drugs. Although, uh, if you keep the drugs, the drugs, you'll probably be killed. I want the pay. Yeah. <laughs> or whatever the droid equivalent of being killed is. Uh, yeah, you find, like... Uh, 40, 40k on him for the spice. Cool. Right, down payment. Because I figure Ace and pays well for spice. He probably does. <laughs> I mean, it's fucking vicious shit. Yeah. It's the exchange. Yeah. So is the guy alive? Uh, no. He just gives me the money? No, you you killed him. <laughs> You didn't say you stopped welling in the <laughs> android just beat him to death. Okay, it went from assault first to just murder. <laughs> Class A felony, hands down. Okay, so at this point, Rose's like, all right, we need to get out of here before the, the, the cops show up. So let's start loading it. So he starts making his way out. Just heads up, Frank and Weedo gets there first. I'm hopping it. <laughs> <laughs> well... Really, real Frank is more of an NPC that I'm gonna have to control, but yeah. Okay, but I like You're controlling Frank, I'm just talking. Yeah, that's <laughs> fine. Let's see. Yep. Okay, so as they, as you guys are about to walk out, that's when you hear Because I assume that yeah. once you get close enough, you're gonna. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You give the little warning. I do oh. the beep boop version of, oh shit, it's the fuzz. <laughs> you got bleep, 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 bleep. fuzz. Ro is like, you got that right. Get cover. And he hides behind one of the crates that's in this warehouse. And he pulls out his gun to get ready. And at this point, you got uh, the cops around the corner. So we see oh, so the, the cops around the corner? Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna use the dead man that I just killed. <laughs> I'm gonna use his carcass as a human shield. Well, as a devil Ar Aronian shield. Yeah. Okay, so give yourself, uh, for now, a bonus. I can't see my sheets. So. Yeah. We'll, we'll just assume you have a bonus yeah, to your soap. Frank has a bonus. No, 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 not Frank. The... Oh, okay, the droid. Yeah, beep boop. I thought we appeared around the corner. Yeah. Uh, and with my other arm, I'm going to start using my tube launcher. Well, I'm going to act for Frank in this. That way we can be fair and balanced on that. <laughs> Otherwise, so I'm just going to use myself, use Frank as a human shield to save your life and then go back. Which, right now, Frank is still alive. Frank, Frank be Josh beats up Josh. <laughs> I'm going to shoot a, I'm going to shoot, so I'm holding a body as a shield, and I'm going to use my tube launcher, like, I, I met, it's like, you know, like, old school, like... Uh, what are we talking about? Like Gundam? Like my claws open up and there's just a tube missile in the middle? Yeah. <laughs> I'm okay. gonna shoot a missile at Frank. Uh, <laughs> roll a green for me. <laughs> Double horseshoe. Okay, so, okay. Go ahead and roll whatever your cool is. Oh, yeah. Cool? Yep. I can pull out your sheet too if you need me to. Give me a second, I'm looking at the stats. It's been a while since I looked at the sheet. No, you're good. Uh, cool is like on the left side of the skills. And they're all in alphabetical order. 
All right, two green. All right, so roll two green. So he had two horseshoes for the advantage. One explosion, one horseshoe. All right, so you got an advantage and a success. And then go ahead and roll your pool. Uh, two green as well. Dang, better than mine. <clears throat> What'd you get? One advantage, what? two success. Yeah. So what is my character made for? Like, no, no, no. strong suit. Steel. One success, two advantage. Yeah. Hey, what what are, are my weapons? Uh, I'm just kind of you got two advantage, one success. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. What what's my most skillfully used weapon? Um, so that's advantage. That's Honestly, success. whatever weapons uh-huh. I gave you, I gave you a right. I haven't seen the sheet, so okay. Nice. okay. I gave you and, uh, a. I just kind of made that stuff up. up, up I gave you a uh-huh. slug thrower pistol and a Triumph combat knife. Trap. Trap. But you probably don't need the knife because of your fist. Let's say I got a combat claws and then a what? A slug, slug thrower pistol. What is that? It's basically a shotgun. A regular. It's a regular bullet gun pistol. Oh, okay. Because in the Star Wars universe, pistol. in the Star Wars universe, if it's a regular pistol, they call it slug throwers because they they shoot slugs instead of lasers. Weapon, energy weapons, which I gave the cops energy weapons. So I'll pump the brakes on using that missile. <laughs> uh, all right, and then let me roll for our NPCs. Actually, I have dice over here, so I'm good. I've got the program that I need. So Frank says, oh shit, not the old man, and I jump in front of the missile. <laughs> and you're sitting like that. He was gonna miss. <laughs> <laughs> Frank, you learned nothing from the academy, boy. Boy. Oh man, Ro is one cool motherfucker. Who? Ro. He's got three cool. My captain. Yeah, captain. Captain, my captain. Oh. Yeah, the because he's Ro Barfield. I mean, or Ro Barfield. Ro Barfield. Barfield. Yeah. Because it's Bo, uh, it's whatever the, the character's name from Smokey and the Bandit is, but with the first letter change. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Three. Oh, he's got three yellow. Because it can be Robert Reynolds. <laughs> and then Fritz also gets to go. And then we'll just use this, we'll use this as the pool from here on out, so that way we don't have to roll every time you guys fight each other. Uh. Although, be prepared to maybe die. If you die, though, at least we got one extra character on True. that side and two extra on this side. So you, oh, can, yeah. you can change sides. Like I guess damn, the robot's amazing. Let's be in his team. <laughs> No, I'm not gonna die. Warning, every new smuggler gets hazed. <laughs> they get lifted and kidney punched. Every cop close to retirement dies. <laughs> Maybe canonically that is their retirement. <laughs> Thank God I got a healthy life insurance policy. That's fucking dark. Alright, so a surprise first go is Fritz. The second, the second mate. So what happened to my missile? Oh, did you throw that? Yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, so that was my opening, like. So you threw. I initiated by shooting. Yeah, you the missile initiated the combat. Come through. And by missile, you mean the Devaronian's body, right? No, like I had a fire missile out of my hand. What weapons do you have? I don't know. He doesn't have that. <laughs> you have, uh, I also, don't you have the Devaronian shield right now? Yeah, well, I guess I'll just shoot him with the pistol then. Okay, yeah, you got a pistol, so you can shoot do that. The pistol. Who are you going to shoot at? Um, you got Frank. It. Frank. God damn it, Frank. All right. <laughs> My partner? Give me... Oh, I, already, I thought I already rolled. Give me a yellow and green for that. No, 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 that was, uh, that was for the... One laser trial. sword and two bangs. <laughs> he got two hits and a triumph. Okay. Well, his it reminds me. Regrets. I've had a few. 
But I did it <laughs> well, my way. He did it, but he still got the trunk, so I'm gonna give it to him. All right. Yeah. So you still hit him. Uh, Bam! Shot him right with a desert eagle. Let's see. It does four damage. And so... Such a desert falcon. <laughs> Primitive weapons. Uh, unfortunately, his soap is exactly four, so he is fine. Holy oh, yeah. yeah. Damn, Frank. What my boat? Well, he's got a riot gun. He's got... He's the... Frank is a shit. <laughs> Let Josh play Frank and the robot. Thing is, though, this is a minion. So, I mean... Yeah, yeah, this minion has right, some better than you guys. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now we're at the top, actual top of the stack. Uh, Fritz is going to go first. Uh, it's going to be Fritz, Jeff, Josh, Dan, Frank, Gro at the bottom. So Fritz is going to fire at at Dan. At my human shield. Fritz is firing at Dan. Fritz is on your side. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Fritz is the, se is the second mate. So he's firing at Dan. First one? Or first Who's one? Who's Dan? I don't know who's Dan, but he's quick. Whatever your name is. My name is Maximus oh, yeah, Stargaze. Max. 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 Old man Max. Squid, squid Officer man. Maximus Stargaze, thank you. Call me Max for short. Alright, so he's gonna fire at Max. So I need to pull up his, which is on this side. Uh, give me, on your side, Dan, roll two purple for me. Two purple? Two circle things and a circle thing and an arrow. <laughs> okay, I need that. <laughs> Alright, so you got threats and a miss. Well, he misses. Hot damn, you need to respect your elder son. I return fire. I probably missed too. It's probably, well. The miss is the train. Is it his... It's actually not your turn. So. Oh, okay. But I will return fire. Just you wait. It just... It's Jeff's turn. <laughs> my turn. It's like we're actually okay. taking I turns am... in this hangar. It's like, God damn it, when it's you. my turn, I'm going to shoot you. <laughs> drop prone. Canonically, that's what we're doing. <laughs> and use my blaster rifle, which is range heavy. Yeah. As a sniper rifle. And my character died. So you're getting thrown in the air. Yes. And I am going to shoot. Josh's. So are you gonna do your sniper team. ability then? Uh, oh, do I have that? I yeah. know I had that. Uh, you have a... I think it's oh no, brush. sorry, you're no, not the sniper. Sorry, sorry you're the medic. This. My bad. Right, yeah. There was a sniper option. Sorry. That threw me off when you said use it like a sniper. Right. You do you have, have other points skills, I'm missing that test? Right. But I'm, I'm gonna dead with that. Arson. I mean, cause these we didn't cover long. Arson. Yeah, it's, it's a long mm -hmm. range. You did not so one bit. You can do that. I can save Arson. Yeah. And I'm going to shoot at Josh's still character. Felony? It's still considered and a felony. It's like, it's like the Manila. Destiny. It's A, B, and C. Class okay. It's like the so I'm going to give you an extra... Yeah, it depends if the yeah, person is uh, still in the middle well, of the yeah. yeah. And the con so it's using, basically contemplating. You would be using... My, the okay, let me stop with the highest to low. But now you're using two uh, Basically, arson one is if the person is still inside the middle of the building. Yep. And then... He needs two yellows and two a green, and, a green. and he's shooting at you, so give me two purple on your side. Hey guys, I'm the last thing you guys about to learn to Alright, so two misses, and then you got three hits, so that, and one man. So you still hit, and you got the advantage. But you didn't crit, so. Right, because I think the crit is... It's a three. Three, yeah. Okay. Damn, my human shield is going to be feeling it. And you did get the boost because of the human shield, so let's see. Nine minus his eight seven. So let's see. Let's give him that. Uh, I'll give him a plus two bonus to it for the human shield. Weedo, <laughs> shout out. Uh, Be Bebop, and Bebop, uh, you got hit. You take six damage. I, I've already accounted for it. Hot dang rookie, that was the best shot I've seen ever since the Jedi Civil War. And not only that, the shot also uh, knocks your Devronian bodyguard uh, out of your hands. So you lost your shield.
But you could always pick it up on like your next turn or whatever. Did we press play? Yeah, I did. Okay. All right. So next up is Bebop, actually, for combat. So what are you going to do? Uh, this guy just shot at you and hit you pretty hard. Okay. Uh, hit me or my meat shield? Uh, hit you for damage and cause your meat shield to be dropped. Okay, how far away are we from, away from each other? I'd say about... Mm, no more than 10 feet. What? Really? It's a small warehouse. Oh my god, I thought you said warehouse. We were like... Okay, well I'm just gonna charge forward and... Give me somebody to maul. Okay. With my claws. I guess... It's reasonable sense to go after the person that just hit him. Okay, mm -hmm. so pick you up and kidney stab you. So, uh, <laughs> it's a green, and then you get a purple. Two bangs. So two hits on this one. Yeah. Okay, and go ahead and take your purple yeah. as your defense. Do I get anything extra for being prone? Uh, you probably actually take a setback for being prone because he's picking you up, I think. <laughs> Well, that's far reach. I might can roll. Oh, actually, yeah. Go ahead and get a boost. Uh, the light blue. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> it didn't matter. Well, it doesn't matter. Well, it doesn't matter. So he picks you up and just goes, kind of Hulk on you. He goes, where, where? Because <laughs> he's prone, so you kind of just grab him by the scruff. Yeah, I laid down to get a good shot, <laughs> which is why he hit you so good. <laughs> I didn't know he was prone. I would have stepped on him. <laughs> kind of like the idea of you picking him up and just dropping him and <laughs> oh, beep, 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 beep. <laughs> All right, uh, you take. Let's see how much damage that would be. Yeah, you get six damage. I do. Mm-hmm. Uh, which you'd only take four of that. Right. Well, uh, still a ten. Yep. All right. Next down the line is Dan. Don't worry, Ricky. Hey, I'm gonna save you. Weedo. Yeah, it's me again. Head. Weedo. Weedo. <laughs> it's it's the old age. So yeah. Doesn't remember, it doesn't, doesn't, remember, remember, doesn't yeah. remember things the way he used to. <laughs> you bet your ass I do. <laughs> I didn't hear that well either. What are you planning to do? I'm going to try to save the rookie's ass. Okay. I'm going to jump on that old loaded droid. <laughs> I'm going to use my combat knife and try to cut some wires. If not, I'm going to tell him a boring war story and hopefully put him to sleep. Okay. <laughs> um, give me your whatever your melee is. It is a yellow and two greens. Sweet. And then you give uh, Josh a yellow, uh, purple and a black. I roll a purple and black? Mm-hmm. Uh, an arrow. Okay. Okay, you still hit. As it hits. Yep, and you got two advantages. Which was not enough for a crit. Um, and your damage doesn't really go through. Like, you, you're kind of just hitting steel against steel. I know, I'm trying to cut some wires. <laughs> you're just like, how does this work? <laughs> you let that boy go, you dang robot. <laughs> so yeah, now you got somebody crawling all over you. There's an old man who you probably assume is like a, like a dog or something because his beard is so big. An old man crawling on me. Yeah, and he's trying to stab you with his combat knife, but it's not effective. <laughs> All right, it's Frank's turn. Frank is going to fire at uh, Fritz, try to take out the second in command. Get up, Josh. You're voicing oh, Frank. Not me. No, you're voicing Frank. 
I, I've got this. I'll I'll take them out. Frank, your voice changed. Most famous you okay? last words ever. <laughs> Partner, I'll take them all out. Frank, I'm seriously worried about you. What your voice changed. What did say before he died? Don't worry, guys. We got this. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have Cybermen in this unit? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, what's it ranged heavy? He has a one in that, so one yellow. And one green. Against a two purple. Alright, he hits. He hits Fritz. Um, let's see how much damage that did. Woo! Okay. Fritz is hurting. He falls to the ground. You just see, so you, you see your buddy, uh, Frank fire at Fritz. And he's got his big riot gun out, so like he's pulling out the heavy weaponry. And you guys are just like, whoa, that like in your mind you're thinking that might be a little much for this. Attaboy, Frank, get those filthy villains. Sorry, oh. criminals. Well don't kill them, we still need our rest and we gotta follow the books. And you just see this big old blast come out and it just goes boom, knocking Fritz to the ground. Damn it, Frank, we're supposed to be arresting these criminals. And then Ro looks over and he's like, Fritz, Fritz, get up for force's sake. Get up. They've killed Fritz. They've killed Fritz. Those lousy, stinking yellow puppies. Those horrible, atrocity-filled vermin. Those despicable warmongers. They've killed Fritz. Uh, Wait a minute, Frank. You're all right. You're all right. You're all right. I just read the code book. You're good. Uh, we can use lethal force. Ro, Ro <laughs> so, in retaliation, Ro begins to fire at you guys. Uh, he fires specifically at Frank. Oh, we definitely need to use Lethal Force now. So, let's see. <laughs> uh, he's got... Ooh, he's got a good one, too. You lads want to hear a story before I rate your bells? <laughs> Woo! Woo! I didn't expect that good. I'll take that as a no. He might kill Frank. I'll take that as a serious no. <laughs> uh, yeah, he got he got enough to kill Frank in one shot. Holy shit! My partner's down. Even with Frank's four soak. Yeah. Jesus! It's Captain Rowe. So yeah, he's still yelling about how angry he is that you guys kill, killed Fritz. And he's like, take that, take this, take that, you green slime, you black-hearted, short, bow-legged. Suddenly, Fritz gets up and starts beginning to split, uh, spit up blood. And he stands up next to uh, Ro and he says, Ro, Ro, I'm okay. I'm okay, Ro, just a scratch. Look, I'm all right. <laughs> and Fritz looks over, and he, uh, Ro looks over at Fritz and he's like, oh, oh, damn. There you go again, stepping on my lines, raining on my parade, costing me medals. <laughs> oh, damn. Suddenly another shot goes by, hitting Fritz, killing him for real this time. Oh, shit. Way to go, Ricky! <laughs> Ricky? <laughs> oh. Oh, Fritz. Fritz, get up for four sake. And he just goes back into the same rant he was just in. <laughs> uh, and, that, and now we're up to Jeff again, because Fritz is dead. <laughs> okay. Uh... I added a little comedy there for you guys. Oh, let me see Comedic flair for a death. Let me pull back up my, uh, my junior. And it kind of worked that Ro was the next in, in, in turn cycle. <laughs> and I only named the character Fritz so I could do that monologue. <laughs> I didn't think you guys would kill him off that quickly, though. I didn't do shit. Yeah, Frank, <laughs> Frank did. Although Frank is dead, too. Fred's dead, baby.
So no Fritz, no Franks. We got rid of the f and the parties. So now you just got Jeff, Josh, Dan, and Robbie. Well, I guess I'm still getting slammed into the ground at this point. <laughs> yeah, so really you, gotta, and repeat. you need yeah. to do an athletics to get out of it. Yeah, it's a yellow and a green for me. And then I need to figure out what it is. Because i got to figure out what he's got to roll in order to stop you. I guess it would just be athletics versus coordination probably. That or athletics versus athletics. I could see that athletics versus yeah, athletics. Yeah, that's probably more. Okay, get, uh, roll a. I usually just give the player the choice. Yeah, uh, roll a Good red. Reason, by the way. Roll a red and a purple. What'd you get on the red? A shield. A shield and um and a shield. Oh, okay. Shields, whatever. Okay. So Round two. I got two hits and an advantage. And those can cancel out that. Uh, what is that icon? That is called a dis disadvantage. Which can be used to cancel out hits. But they cannot, but they're usually used to cancel out advantages. Right. So what I would say in this case, it, the advantage is canceled out and then one of your hits are canceled out. And then that means you still manage to get out of the... Okay. okay, so you got out of it, and that's I'd say that's half your turn, so what do you want to do? Uh, can I still attack? Uh, no, you can probably run away, though. Yeah. Well, if, you feel, if you feel you need to get space between him. Because now we know the knife doesn't work on the robot. <laughs> Considering you see old man Max still on top of him going... <laughs> Trying to get through. Gosh, why can't even feel me on his back right now? <laughs> no, no, you're you're just like a bug that like to him. Like he's about to swat you off on I'm his. Gonna end this session here. He's gonna swat you off on his next turn. I was just completely ignore me. I'm not even doing any damage. <laughs> you just I'm gonna, go. I'm gonna kill the cops. Kill my captain. Take the drugs and the money. And go find an island somewhere. That'll be epic. <laughs> Well, you're near. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just like back up. Okay. I'll try to get some distance. So you get 15 feet away. Do I get opportunity attack? Uh, not in this system. Oh. Okay. Do you, you want to get like outside and all that? Because it, it's pretty closed in area here. So do you want to kind of like go outside a bit, get a, give yourself more space, or kind of creep more inward? Uh, no, just kind of go out. Okay. A little bit. All right, and that's your turn. Uh, we are now on Josh. I'm going to take the old man, throw him to the ground, and start kidney stabbing. <laughs> All right, give me athletics to get him off of you. It's my bread and butter technique. <laughs> so, the stabby uh, stash to hell. Yellow and green. And then what's your athletics? Because you're trying to stay on, I assume, right? Yeah. Uh, two bangs, two horseshoes. All right, two hits and an advantage. Two you said two to two, you said? Two and two. Two bangs, two horses. Okay, so two advantage, two hits. And then what's your athletics, you Give said? Give me one second. I don't know what the difference is in those. Advantage is basically a higher... A higher hit? Yeah, yeah. And they can be used to do a little bit more. Like if you... If you're using like a weapon, they're used as your crits. Two greens and one yellow. Okay, so you want to do two purples and a red for me. Two purples and a red. Okay, so you do not get them off because you cancel out completely on each other. So you're just kind of going... <laughs> for my turn or do I get a fallback? Uh, you can do more. Okay, I'm going to slam my ground into the back. <laughs> You mean you're back to the ground? Yes. <laughs> you're grinding to your no, back. No, I'm going to slam my ground into <laughs> the back. Perfect. All right. I'm just going to people's elbow body that's just, drop. I think, that, I think that's just a brawl. 
I think that's a brawl Yeah, move. I think that's a brawl move. So another yellow and a green, and a pur just a purple. Uh, crit, bang, and horseshoe. Or sword, horseshoe, bomb. Okay, so triumph. Ooh. Yeah, he hit you. Yep. Yeah. So, hey, he's a gap man, because I can defend yeah. with one purple. Because that triumph was enough to... Mm -hmm. To automatically do it. All right, and I'd say twelve, probably. For I'm dead. Like that. Well, no, because you've got your. I think I'm dead. Have you taken damage already? Yeah. Well, I know. When did you take damage? I don't think I took damage. But I think I'm dead. What's your threshold? Well, what's your you? So remove two from that. So that's only ten. Because you've got a soak value of two. And what's your your uh, wounds threshold? It's a a 16. 16. So, I, so, so I should six. take a penalty because I'm an old man, though. You're fine. You're a commando. Okay. I'm an old man. So you have six. You have six he health. has six left. Yeah. Now he's got a disadvantage. Yeah, now now on your turn, you've got a disadvantage trying to get out of there. <laughs> yeah. And he's got a disadvantage getting up. <laughs> he's a heavy robot. <laughs> Oh, that's right. He did just slam back down. Yeah. Uh, How the uh, hell did you get two turns? What the fuck? No, no, no. Because <laughs> one it, half trying to get you, and then the other half was him doing that. Because you could probably do that in six seconds. Did I, I embed I had, the knife into I him? I guess or I'm myself? a dual core unit, like a dual core. Did processor. I embed my knife into him or me? <laughs> Neither. It's kind of like. Well, was like this. Stab and a me. robot. Yeah. yeah, he was trying to stab you. <laughs> I was trying to cut your wire, but he didn't let me oh, cut no, your wire. Oh, no, that'd be great, because you're going for a stab, and then you back away, and then I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> and you hit my oil can, and it's just, like, leaking everywhere. Uh, all right, Dan. You got to try to get out of this? Which I highly doubt I'll be able to get out of because it, you're a heavy robot. Let me make sure I wiggle a little bit. So I only have two rooms? Uh, so I have two weapons? Uh, for now, yeah. You can buy more later. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Right there was my backup the plan. Theme. Play me the Giles theme while I backslam this guy. <laughs> I dig! Well, I guess this is the perfect time of any to recall a war story about that one time a tank fell on me. <laughs> is that all you're gonna do? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I. Man, I can't do anything. I have a, like a two-ton robot stuff. One point of damage that does nothing because of soak? <laughs> I mean, you're stuck under a robot. I mean, what else is am I going to do? Okay. I mean, I don't have any weapons to get them all. I can't have access to the weapon. You could use athletics to get out, though. I mean, I guess. Let's go, old man. One bang, one horseshoe, one another horseshoe. Okay, so... Yeah. Two advantages and a hit. Yeah. Uh, alright. Give me... What was his again? I don't even remember. Let's go, old man. Oh, give me a... Ooh, give me a purple. Beat bot, motherfucker! Two of, Was it this one? Yeah. Okay. You still managed to get out. So you get out, you crawl out from under him, like, going... Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> So you just go like, like you. At the same time, I'm telling my story. <laughs> oh man, this reminds me of that one day I got trapped underneath that thing. Ugh. This is exactly <laughs> how I got out. Bam, Carl, on my is way. He passive, is he in the past tense telling the stories of what's happening now? Yeah, I'm trying to bore you to death. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Is it Jeff's turn? Uh, or is it the captain's turn? It'd be the captain's turn. The first mate died. Well, yeah. Oh damn! Uh, oh, do you get a? Actually, you get a. That was only half your turn. Do you oh, want to yeah. try to get away? You want to join Jeff f f further away? I'm gonna shoot the robot. <laughs> you can't, that's Guys, an attack. I'm sorry if my mood ruined this. No, you're good. No, you're good, dude. Uh, that's just an attack. I don't think you can do an attack because I told Jeff he can't. Yeah, you just have to do like a quick action, basically. Why can't you? What are you doing? Because know. he used half his turn to get out from under you. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm just going to keep you guys off your feet. <laughs> <laughs> Next, I'm going to do a leg sweep. 
God dang it, stop trying to trip an old man! <laughs> Alright, what can I do? Uh, you got a few things. You, I mean, you could run away. You could uh, also, let's see, you're the... You're the commando, so let's see. Special moves include... Uh, add a boost. Oh, you... You forgot that I forgot to let you out a boost. I did that athletics check, but you're fine. Um, yeah, that would have definitely helped me when you try to slam me. That would have. Uh, point blank, add one damage per rank of point blank. So on your next turn, when it, if you're close enough to him, you could do that. I am close enough to him. Do it. You know what? Fine. I'll do allow, it. You know what? From here on out, do I'll it. allow attacks at, at the end of getting out of stuff. I'm sorry, Jeff. That's all right. This is, this is my first time doing this. Shoot so, me! Okay, yeah, go ahead and do your point blank. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Did my did my story bore him any? Or caught him off guard? I mean, I would think. Was he, was kill he all listening? the cops? They're gonna start calling me Rock'em Sock'em Bebop. Uh, <laughs> I know. Actually, this is there Bebop, Bebop, hold Bebop. Hold on, Bebop. Give me a. <laughs> do it. Give me a yellow and a green. Am I trying to bore him to death? Yeah. <laughs> Two bangs and a horseshoe. Okay, and then... What did I give? Give me... I'm looking at your stats to see which one makes sense. Would it be charm? Just because... Except you're using charm evilly. How's that evil? I'm telling old war how I got out of the tank. So you're trying to charm. I guess. So two green. Oh. Well... There's that. There's that. So what'd you get? I got a bang, a horseshoe, and a horseshoe. Okay, and what did you get? I think the exact opposite of what I got. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so let's see. We cancel? No, hold on. Yeah, you guys completely canceled out. <laughs> so you try to charm me and I just look at you. No, I just told you. No, I didn't charm you. I he was actually trying to bore you. I was trying to bore you. If he, now if he, what time I got out of that tank? I'm calling it. Like, if he had oh, this old man. If he had succeeded, I would have given you a strain on that. <laughs> I was like, shut the fuck up. Okay. Because uh, strain is more mental type damage. All right, now whose turn? Uh, now it is the captain's. So the captain is making his way over to the to the spice and says, we're just going to get out of here. And he starts to move the spice shipment. And he, oh, he's still in your spice. He's going through the back door. And he's Did going the captain through the spice? Yeah, yeah, through the back door. Good captain. <laughs> I'm busy. <laughs> Make a run for it, Bebop, he tells you as he's running out. Okay. <laughs> and so he makes his way to the ship. Okay. Whose turn is it? It is now Jeff's. Who now has at least some distance between you and... And... <laughs> Him. You at least have 15 feet now. I'm going to hit a knee. So you're not going to fully uh, go prone this time. you only go halfway. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so nothing changes. <laughs> well, he was standing. Now he's going. Now he's on a knee. And I am going to blast a rifle bebop. And rock steady. Huh? And rock steady. Keep up with Rocksteady. Who's Rocksteady? Never mind. Bebop got the order to flee, but is Bebop still on the ground? Uh, yeah, he's still lying down, so you actually would get a uh, advantage. So I have a yellow and two green, so what's that? Wait, I thought you only got advantage on prone targets if it's melee. If it's ranged, I'm making a smaller target. <laughs> You're a pretty big robot and heavy. <laughs> <laughs> You are a big robot. And really heavy. I'll just give you the regular roll. It, and that should be fine. Alright. And then, uh, two purple. Right. Two, two shields. shields. Okay, you still make it through. Barely. By one. Right. Barely, by one. So that's nine damage. Ouch. Yeah, the damage is done. My robot, my space armor. <laughs> beep boop beep boop. <laughs> we get it here from to space. Go, but... so you haven't noticed I'm not putting this old man in a very dangerous right. situation. Should I use a destiny disc? No, because I'm about to use one. <laughs> okay, because you're. This shot will kill you. So go ahead and. Oh, it. 
It will. It's gonna kill me? Yeah, so do what you're gonna do. I don't live with one HP. Uh, six plus eight is over your max, which is eleven. Whoa, he kills me in one shot two. right out? Two. It took two shots. He shot remember. you earlier. I shot you earlier. It focuses on his fire on before, you. Before the phone call. Yeah. I'll, take the, I'll take the kill. I'll okay. take the death. Okay. As long as I get a reaction. Okay, yeah. So, like, I'm just... <laughs> holding. <laughs> I swear to God, you fall on my ass again. Okay, so I'm going to epic point. <laughs> fall on my ass. Fall I'm going to... Uh, because they're both pretty close to me, right? Uh, He's 15 feet away, but he's pretty close. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to do a flying Hail Mary and just land <laughs> on all men on the ground and self-destruct. Are you going like platoon? <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually like more platoon style with like bolts going through. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm the old man with the beard. I'm taking you out with me, old man. <laughs> with <the> <laughs> <eye>. <laughs> we're definitely at, we're definitely gonna have you re-roll on your neck so you can get another character out. Anyways, <laughs> I'm gonna turn into the uh, Weedu, the rookie. <laughs> and slow motion, I'm taking the knife and my beard just majestically flowing in the air. Uh, let's see. This is gonna be my finishing move for him from now on. This whole time. So this does kill you too. Cause... Yeah, he will kill me. <laughs> yeah. All right. So <laughs> they both have to roll this game. I just start. Pew, 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 and by pew, roll, pew. we mean literally roll. <laughs> There's a one d six. Where's the D6 at? So both of them die to good explosion. So we can't have two, four, and five. Yeah, so cannot use two, four, or five. One, three, or six, boys. Yep. You just roll over and you're like trying to tell me a story and I just fucking bounce letting you explode. What'd you got? Three. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's either one or six. One or six, right? Yep. Higher or low? Six. Okay. Six. So we got three and six? Yep. Alright. There's only one character left. So don't die again. Choose your dice wisely. I was about to die. Well, now yeah, you're, you're on the smuggler side. <laughs> and now you're on the militia side. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll swap seats. Welcome back, Frank. <laughs> I'm Frank too. Actually, now you're a Trandoshan sniper. I don't know what that means. I thought you called him a transgender sniper. No, he's a Trandoshan sharpshooter. Uh, Trandoshans are like the big reptile looking guys. I'm a lizard man. Yeah. Lizard man with a gun. And you are a Gand charmer, so think like if Lando was a Gand. Alright. What's All a right. Gand? Uh, let me pull up a picture. Ladies and gentlemen, I am now playing a charisma type character. Yes, you are. Welcome to the Mambo number five. I already missed Max. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, that voice, that voice he was trying to tell you before the explosion, it wasn't saying anything epic or remember him. It said, tell Martha I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> tell Martha <laughs> She's not on the life insurance. <laughs> so funny See? enough, funny enough, this is another bug-like creature. How the hell is it a charm anybody? <laughs> hey, it's a real charmer. He's got it. He's got the moves. I should right. take a penalty on that. No, don't worry. I gave you some stats that make it work. Right, <laughs> let me send. Let me send the new sheets. You know what? I'll just I'll just hold the sheets because it's working out pretty well. Me just telling you guys what rolls you need to make. Yeah. I just need to keep a better eye on your talents. Right. Yeah. Can I borrow your charger? Yes. I would have bored him to death. I'm at, I'm at 72, so go ahead. I'm at 7. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, okay, that's one hell of a way to get your feet wet. You lost two of your partners. Your right. supervisor. <laughs> and I'm a medic who, who turned into a sniper. <laughs> and now you have an official sniper. And now I have an official sniper. All right, so... We're gonna cut to the on the ship, because your, your character was on the ship during all this. All right. So... All you hear is a row running. He's like, "Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit!" And he comes in with like rowing with the with the spice, and he closes the ship. And he's like, "We need to get off here now." All right, all right, hold your horses. So you start to put in that, the charts. Mm -hmm. All right, give me two green. Thank you, Callie. And then I'll put one on my end. One boom, one horseshoe. 
So a hit and an advantage. One boom, one horseshoe. I love it. Uh, okay, yeah, you're good. All right, so you start to get the ship ready to take off. And he's like, okay, uh, so we lost Fritz. I saw that. I saw that. Yeah, I was a bit mad, as you saw, about losing Fritz. Not my problem. You told me to stay on the ship. Yeah. We also lost uh, Bebop. Okay, now I'm sad. <laughs> <laughs> I, at least I believe we lost Bebop. I ran. <laughs> it, it, it. I had to take the goods. Goods came first. I mean, from what I saw on the screen, it looked like Bebop did majority of the work here. <laughs> hey, let's not feel sorry for the forklift. Let's go. <laughs> so anyways, he gets in the pilot's seat and starts to get ready to... Because you're in the co-pilot. Yeah. And so he starts to get ready to take off. Uh, at this point, we're going to... So uh, let me do his role, actually. His pilot role. To see if you guys can make it where you need to. I just realized what I did. <laughs> I'm ashamed. <laughs> Especially since it's the wrong franchise. Uh, Although they're both about people driving all the time and getting in trouble with the law. <laughs> I love it. Uh, let's see. So he's got a planet space of four. Jeez. Is that an agility? Yeah. So he's got three yellow and a green. Who the hell has that? Row. The captain. Yeah, the captain. His piloting is a four for space. Uh, and he got two successes and an advantage, so I think he gets out of here. Yeah, I think he won that one. So, yeah. So you, you hear the ship starting to take off in the back. And, of course, at this point you're like, fuck. Right? <laughs> Can I go search... Uh, uh, the bodies. The bodies, yeah. Yeah. So, who, who are you searching? Uh, search the big robot first. Okay. Well, you find 40,000 credits, son. Um. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. That's <laughs> evidence, rookie. So, uh, <laughs> well, no other... Fuck you. I mean, to be fair, no other law enforcement's there. He could take it if he wanted. So, uh, I'm just going to put that in my pocket. <laughs> oh! Uh, and... Uh, I was an officer in training. I just approved your actions. <laughs> so, I'm also going to pick up the old man's dead body. Okay. And carry it back. Okay. See, me. see, he's got some honor. Okay. You know what? But tell Martha I hate her. You know what, Dad? <laughs> All right, Caleb, you're on traffic duty uh, today. Make sure that state was nice and tight. So you're your way back to the station, essentially. No, not to the station. We're actually going to go to the old man's home. You know where Martha lives. Oh, okay. And I'm gonna. Dump his dead body on the porch <laughs> and leave ten thousand credits on his chest so she can bury him with. Oh no no you you she doesn't get shit. <laughs> no, we had a deal. He just gave her some dirty this is money. For your funeral, you know. Okay. Just make sure. He just gave her some dirty money. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, he gave her the ten thousand ten thousand out of that out of that forty. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least I get buried. Right. 30,000 tuition fees. They're high, man. <laughs> You're a corrupt cop with at least an honor system. Right? <laughs> <laughs> He's traumatized that he lost both his, like his supervisor and his partner. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm yeah. assuming now you report back to base a little yeah. Yeah, that you, way they can get a chase going. Yeah, you wrote your narrative and everything, your police report. You handed it to the chief, yada, yada, yada. You get to sign a new So what'd you, write in, what'd you write in the police report? Uh... Frank was brutally murdered by the captain. Okay. And uh, I dropped the old man off at his wife's. You probably, no, no, you probably want to pick that out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The old man was blown up by the big there machine. There you go. <laughs> by the big machine. He was, he was blown to pieces in a fiery explosion. That also happened to kill the machine. Yeah, and killed the machine. And the first mate's dead as well. Okay. So really now... For all you know, it's just the captain. Yeah. For all he knows. <laughs> I'm not being mean or anything, but stuff like that you want to leave out of a police report. 
that she just gave the body of an officer to his wife and dirty money. Well, well he, he, he left the dirty money out. Oh, they would be asking for that body back. <laughs> okay, so, uh, although they're going to probably check the crime scene and be like, where's the body? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got eviscerated. Oh, yeah, I got evis- eviscerated. I mean, by eviscerated, we See, mean... See, that his narrative. He's yeah. fine. Yeah. I know it looked look like it, anyways, from yeah. the droids in. Anyways, so the captain comes in and says, All right, well, uh, we still need to start uh, chase going. We can't let them get too far. Uh, I don't know where they're going, but we need to stop them. All I know is it's for the exchange. Uh, I'm, I'm assigning you your new partner, and in comes Josh's new character. The, you see this big reptilian guy with a, with a gun shot to his back and everything. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, right. now we got to start naming. All right, all right. we got to start naming, and I'm going to give you more alignment. I want good cop, bad cop. The classic trope. Why do I have to be the bad guy? You're you already... stole the money! <laughs> <laughs> that was just because I took some money. That's <laughs> that just wants to check out. Okay, yeah. you're Denzel. You're Denzel Washington in this Cops case. don't make much money, man. <laughs> what, 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 what was that, uh, what hey, was that movie, hey, Denzel, and what yeah, was the cop? Yeah, it's uh, Training Day. Training yeah. Day. You're so, Denzel Washington. Say Monica real slow. Monica? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you're Denzel Washington from Training Day. All right. Why do we not want to name your new guy? So what am I again? Uh, yeah, Lizard Man Sniper? Yeah. I am Gojira. Gojira. <laughs> <laughs> and the captain says, this is Gojira. This is your new partner. Uh, this is Weedo, your new partner. <laughs> now <to> shoot. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this is all you get is a speech impediment? <laughs> no, it's my lizard tongue. Is most, like, most of them speak with like an ass type. Yeah. Type. With hiss. Yeah, with the hiss. Nice to meet you. <laughs> All right, I need you out there right now. We're giving you a ship to go after them. All right. All right, so you guys get there, and you see this nice... <laughs> Shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> so you see this nice uh, ship kind of similar to the Boba Fett, Jango Fett ship, because, uh, fun fact, that is actually a police cruiser in the Star Wars universe that Jango Fett took <laughs> nice. and remodeled it himself. Awesome. That's actually like a model that they've said is like the law enforcement models. I like it. So you've got that type of ship. All right. Uh, what color do you want it to be? Can't Yellow. be. Yeah, okay, I was about to say can't be purple because that's what the, the Smoky Bandit ship is. <laughs> so you got this nice yellow type ship. Okay. With sirens, of course. Yeah, with the s- sirens and everything. All right. So I'm guessing you're making your checks. Right. Uh, well, since he's in the co-pilot seat. He has to do the astrogation, and then you have the piloting. Uh, Josh, give me two green. Am I doing planetary or space? Uh, it doesn't matter. Space. They're, space. Actually, they're the same. Oh, it's okay. Well, it's it's space. Just to. Uh, uh, Josh got a hit and a advantage. Okay. And I got two hits. Are they assisting each other? Uh, well, one's doing astrogation. One's actually oh, piloting. Right, right. So one's setting up the course, and then one is... So Josh just drew us out this awesome-ass course, and I just fucked it. <laughs> what did you say he got? He got a hit and an advantage. He still did not do well. Uh, and then you got two, two hits. hits. Uh, you managed to get it flying, though. Uh, oh, but you're not going directly on the course. or But you don't know that. Because you don't even know how to track them completely, because you don't know where they're at. Okay. You I just, mean, you are a rookie. Well, also, they took off, like, yeah. I, honestly, it's probably been, like, 30 minutes since yeah. they took off. Oh, they had a long they got a good lead. Yeah, they got a good lead. So, really, it's going to come so down. Far, no, so far, everything makes sense. So, it now it's going to be, like, tracking them down at this point. All right, so going back to our smugglers. I'm kind of upset that uh, you didn't get on their side, because I... I kind of want you guys to be all on one side. It'd be kind of fun. Because then I don't have to cut back and forth and it can be a mystery. Why don't you just make my guy an undercover cop? No. <laughs> That's um, why I just sat there the whole time. All right. Uh, and reminder, you're using dark side points now. Okay, yeah. We have one dark side because uh, Josh used one of the gold blue. It actually goes away. Okay, so. What? Then it no, away. it flips. It flips. It flips. But one's already flipped, and then he used one. 
Did he use one? No, he used cop? one to no, blow up. He used one as a cop. He used, he used one, one to blow dark. up. Oh, well then it's should that one should be a light. So you're fine. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It just continues to flip. Yep. Oh, okay. it's a it's basically the flowing of the force. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is completely one sided. <laughs> All right, uh, all right. So you guys are kind of following this navigation, and you see this buoy kind of leading you in where you think is the right direction. A navigational buoy. Are you talking to me or them? To you. Oh shoot, I'm not driving. Yeah, but you, you're like <laughs> astrogation. You're yeah, like okay. you're co you're copilot. I'm copilot. Yeah, you're copilot. Especially since you know the previous copilot's dead. <laughs> Fritz died. Don't have a choice. Yeah. Yeah, I got promoted. Yeah, you got promoted because somebody died. Best way to get promoted. I know, there's no job security, apparently. <laughs> hey, it works for the Empire. <laughs> yeah, we used to, we used that to our advantage a lot. <laughs> a lot of people died to put B9 in the exchange. Alright, so, <laughs> as you approach, um, give me a... Let's see, he's the charmer. What would be a good thing for a... I have a bad feeling about this. Would that be a survival... Oh, actually, that'd probably be a vigilance check. Yeah, that'd be vigilance. Okay, mm -hmm. give me a yellow and two greens. A bang, a horseshoe, and a bang, and a horseshoe. Okay, you're good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so... You kind of sense that there's something off about the direction you're going. And it's at this point that you start to, that a shot goes off and you feel the ship shake. Man, this is not me, bro. Are you sure you don't want me to drive? Uh, I think we're being under attack. Oh. Uh, gotcha. <laughs> uh, do you look I'm going to go man the gun, just in case. Okay. So and as you're manning the guns, you see a small group of pirate ships coming at you. <sighs> they were also There's no pirate honor among ships. thieves. <laughs> well, but pirates are different than smokers. Pirates, yeah. pirates don't work for other yeah, people. No they work for themselves. True. They don't know what you got. They're just like, hey, a ship. <laughs> and it fell into our trap. They shot at us, right? Yeah. So, okay. are you gonna fire back? Yeah, heck yeah. All right. Give me every day, all day. Two green. Just two green. Yeah, that's your gunnery. A horseshoe, a horseshoe, and a horseshoe, and a horseshoe. You actually succeed. <laughs> you had four advantages. Well, four advantages versus three th threats left him one advantage. Yeah, you make it. Uh, let's see what the ship is. I have not actually looked at the ship stats yet. I feel like I'm playing myself. I'm playing myself. I already miss Max. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see, what kind of ship will we have? I don't know, I'm playing Max. <laughs> you know what, I'll give him that one. Okay, so you did... How much damage does it do? It does five damage. All right. And the ship you're hitting... Damn, I'm not Mandalorian. I could just took that tank. Well, time. they're only driving the equivalent of TIE Fighters. Yeah. Uh, so they already... One of them goes down. That's the end of one of them. All does right. this send an intimidation factor towards the other ship? Uh, one of them does start to veer off. That's good. And there's like, so that leaves you only one more target to have to worry about. Sweet. Uh, meanwhile, the captain is starting to make evasive maneuvers. I hope he does. So he's got to make a roll now, too. I got, I got oh, okay. for it. Oh yeah, he had four. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot he was really good. Three yellow, one green? Yep. God damn. Woo! I, I say that succeeds. The captain just took your ship and, and literally shoved it down a TIE fighter's throat. 
He did two, come out of the other TIE so, Fighter's ass. So he did two triumphs, three advantages, and a success. So he basically got you out of there. Nice. He was just like, nope, we don't got time for this. Whoop. And you want to roll down the window and snipe? <laughs> <laughs> you get sucked out. What are you doing? <laughs> Good thing he's not there. Otherwise, you'd also get sucked out. He's on his team. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It's a good thing he's not there. Uh, anyways. Uh, in fact, now that that combat is over, yeah, it's your there. turn. So, you guys need to make another check to see if you can find them. Yeah. Uh, Which jumps us to GPD, Galactic Police Department. So, I'd say survival makes sense for a tracking type thing. I think I'm going to falls for him for navigation. But they're tracking you, that's the thing. Yeah. Also, this one's not yours. Yeah. Oh, I know what mine is. I was... Yeah, this one's mine. Mine's, mine's too green. Yeah. Well, this is your survival if that's what you want to use. Instead of navigation. Let's cut this real fast. Oh. Now. And actually, you have three green for power. Do I? Yeah. Why does mine only show two? You hear me, fellas? Are you sure you're looking at mine? Minutes. Yeah, the Rodian Medic. Oh, it is three. Yep, so you missed one last time. Well, oh, you wow. passed anyways. Yeah. Apparently, we have to wrap this up in 15 minutes. Ah, uh, one, two, three. Ah, uh, four. Okay. Let's see. One, two, three, four hits? Yeah. So that's all hits. All right, you make it. You, you're, you've you kind of make your way back towards them, and you're actually getting closer now. You can tell. Something in the space. <clears throat> Something does not seem right. In fact, you're actually on their tail now. So. Are we doing a space battle? Well, it's a chase. I don't recall having a turn. Am I missing something? That well, he just took your turn. The group turn to kind of oh, okay, okay, track okay, them well. down. Uh, is there anything you wanted to do now that you no, tracked I'm them down? No, I'm fine with that. I was, I wasn't quite following. And well, now that we're like right on their tail, you can actually shoot them. Are we in space? Yeah. Yeah. Without no, shooting, you. don't. So I can open <laughs> the window and snipe. <laughs> Allow him to do that. I won't. I kind of want okay, to. Okay. So okay. Better yet, I'm. I have a spacesuit on. Uh, I'm in the hangar. I'm gonna open the hangar and zip line across. <laughs> the other I mean, so you're getting dragged through hyperspace. <laughs> Well, no, this isn't hyperspace. You guys are in just, like, regular space. <laughs> We're still traveling, though. You realize that much force hey, that zip line was twice the half. I'm throwing away. So. <laughs> I'm going to open the hangar bay door and try to zip line to a ship. Who the hell gave you a badge? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that zip line was cut him in half. Uh, well, as you're getting the zip line ready, you notice a... Dozen of asteroids starting to come in the path for both of you. Fuck them. Like both. Of you. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna die. A small rock would go and kill you. Whatever. One can just pop <laughs> your suit. of a dice can kill you. Like one can pop his suit easily. Just hold your breath. That's why it's a zip line. I'm gonna go across real fast. <laughs> <laughs> I want to turn to the captain. I think this problem is gonna take care of itself. Okay, I'll activate one of those droid shields. So the boing boing if it hits my shield. Boing boing boing. Uh, you also notice a bunch of giant bugs on the asteroids. <laughs> Fuck them! I'm trying to zip line to a goddamn ship right All now. Right, That's what I'm doing. Mean... You're being dragged through space. All right, Netflix. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm... kill all the bugs with my zip How are you not dead? As you're being give me, dragged through give space. me a yellow and two greens. And I know what I'm rolling for this. Fuck physics. <laughs> I got a double bang, double horseshoe, and a bang. Three bangs and two horseshoes. You damn white know that was an horseshoe or something. I thought that that's what it was. No, that's what I saw. Blank. Uh, was there a blank? Yeah, it was a blank. I didn't see no blank. It was a blank. I did not see this no blank. This one was a blank. I don't no, know. I saw five thingies. <laughs> I don't know. That don't was know a blank. Glasses. I'll give him what he said. All right. You're a smuggler. Nobody takes your word for it. I'm using charm. <laughs> hey, he's giving me like ten... He's trying to kill me ten ways to Sunday. I think I'll take an extra two points. So, <laughs> you're trying to kill yourself. That's what you're trying to do. Oh, you know what? I don't have to do that because I'm going to use a... Use a light point. 
Oh. Auto success. Well, actually, uh, give me turn one of those greens to a yellow and roll the yellow. Oh my bad. Well, I'll just get rid of that negative that Dan said. Yeah. Well, roll the. Hey, give the hell. Roll the yellow. Let him roll it. I'm trying to. They keep passing me back the yellow. I just. Okay. So what you got? Blank. Blank. They hit each other. No, no, it had something. It did have something. It right. was two of those. So what do you so got? So we got three bangs, three horseshoes. I'm still gonna die. He still has a threat. <laughs> and a success. So he succeeds. <laughs> but as you as you start as you're getting closer, you don't really have a chance of stopping. So you kind of uh, Tarzan you kind of George <laughs> up the jungle into it. Okay. But am I dead? No. Nah. Then why does it matter? Uh, I think maybe a soap would pick it up. Yeah, I'd say. So what are you piloting? What's I'm not piloting soap? anything. What, 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 what ship are they on? Should it be a free damage? And what ship are they on? Takes yeah. one. Yeah. What kind of ship are they on? So fourteen. Uh, they are on a. I had it. Hold on. Hey Caleb, I'm gonna activate our windshield wipers. <laughs> well, he's on. The, he's on <laughs> the, he's the side, on the side of, the of the ship. ship. Yeah. I mean, is it like a frigate, a cargo ship? What it's a it? cargo. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna so now I'm gonna plant some thermal charges. <laughs> you don't have thermal charges on your character. I do. No, you do not. If I did it, you definitely don't. He doesn't. Destiny point to give him some thermal charges? That's a bullshit. <laughs> I mean, you I blew his roll out. Well, that was my yeah. plan. I'd assume I'd have taken some with me. You know what? Go ahead and flip the destiny. Well, you mean from the window? Yes. So now you got a bunch of dark stuff. So you do. All right. There's one over here, actually. So. So it's three, three. All right. I'm giving you three thermals. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put them right on the thermal vent. The the most explosive part of the ship. <laughs> I want to ask about dark side point. Is that what? And <laughs> and. <laughs> They're triggered if my heartbeat stops. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, that's perfect. I'm going to activate a dark point. Okay. That negate. And it's a dead man switch, and if my hand comes off the trigger, it blows. I think you can only do one. You know what? And yeah, it's on a 30 second timer. I can't all that. Okay, anyway. You know what? No. no I'm put it on the Hold on. I, can I explain how this works? Okay. Only one of them is a dead man switch. Only one of them <laughs> is the uh, heartbeat. And then only one of them is on the timer. Okay. Okay, and anyway. Now I'm gonna can try I to zip any point again? Now I'm going to try to zip back across the our uh, ship. No, that's it's too many cool. moves. That's oh, too that's, many moves. That oh, is go. too many moves. No, Dan, this is in your favor. No, no, listen. That is, no, it's fine. It's fine. Too oh, listen, moves. I'm going to use the dark side point. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to flip it over to the light side. I don't have the thermal vent that you place it on. Blow it right back at him. So he just turns it on and... <laughs> well, no, I wasn't going to put it in the fucking vent. I would have died. You put it on the vent. Ever. No, you put it on the vent, so I'm going to have the vent blow it off. I don't think we're on the same page. That's how vents work. Vents throw. I didn't put it literally in the vent. You said you put, put it on, no, on the We know you didn't put it in the vent. You said, you said you said you put it on, on the vent. Okay, well that's one. Okay, so one of them's just now attached to you. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> I wasn't planning to make it out. No, but which was one? <laughs> but which one? Uh, let's see. Hold on. Uh, by the way, I didn't press the switch. The ship did it on its own. So I guess one. The first one should be the timer. Second one should be the dead man switch, and then the third one should be the heartbeat. Somebody roll it. Uh, I, I got it. I got it. All right. Which one landed on? Them? It was the heartbeat one. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so when you die, you blow up. <laughs> okay. God damn it, be nice. <laughs> if he doesn't blow up in the first place. <laughs> His name's got zero in it. Go zero. Go zero. Who the fuck gave you a bat? So now whose turn is it? Uh, it is Rose. Actually, it's the bug creatures that are eating the asteroids. Oh, geez. Well, we didn't bother them. There's, they still get actions. But they're I mean, people too. <laughs> we they're just, bug people. I, I don't think they'd people. be. I don't think they'd be aggressive since. No, they're not. But the bother. asteroids are hitting probably that they're living on. I'm pretty sure I'm good enough to keep away from those. You know what? Give me a give me a piloting. You know what's funny is I I made that roll daunting and he somehow passed. I gave him five purples on that roll to zip line. Two hits and an advantage. Uh, you 
take hits from asteroids. Damn. Uh, your ship takes. <laughs> oh no, sorry. You you managed to not get hit. Sorry. Oh, I really wanted to activate windshield wipers just to be funny. <laughs> But the, <laughs> the creatures do notice you guys kind of getting into their area. They're like, right. this, this is our home. Like, they're not saying that. They're like making noises that are definitely aggressive. Yeah. All right, it's Ro's turn. Okay. Well, he has to also make the same check. He'll, we all know he'll pass, but you know. Might yeah. as well. It's only fair. Yeah, he passed. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah. For advantage, he's in a success. He also uses those advantages to kind of start to shake you a little bit, just to mess you up a bit. All right, your turn, Dan. Because you haven't actually had a turn. I mean, what I'm going to do is... Just... Well, there's still a ship on your tail. I mean, this is, I know there's a ship on our tail. What I'm going to do is zip line out there and kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> You I did it. it. Do it! <laughs> Just no, do I'm it. I'm obeying physics, so I'm not doing that. Are you going to use the astrogation to make another jump then? Oh! oh. <laughs> Drag us with you. <laughs> we'll be dead! It don't blow up! Exactly, but he's still connected to your shit. What's the, lazy, what's the latest canonical explanation for two ships ziplining together and one goes to warp? You there. get ripped in half! Yeah, there currently is none, <laughs> but I would assume it's not good for the other ship that's being dragged, and I'm, I'll also assume it's not good for the no. person that's in the not middle. Good. But anyways, I guess we're going! You realize your ship's gonna blow up. I mean, kills him, drags you with us. We might survive. We're all gonna die. <laughs> We're all gonna die. That's one way, hell of a way to do this. Cause end of the night. You're gonna kill Josh. He's gonna drop his thing because he's dead. He's gonna blow up because he's still on the side of your ship. Alright, so. Has it even been 30 seconds yet? Because in 30 seconds, one blows up any damn Well, we're gonna end this in two minutes, so that's what I'm doing. Uh, so give me two. Give I'm me, gonna end it all on my turn. Give me two green. Two green. Probably ejection pod, Dan. Oh, sorry. How the fuck are you gonna ejection pod out of your space suit? No, he's saying line. he would recommend you would get out. <laughs> Two bangs and a horseshoe. All right, so I love everybody's using my system yep, now. Yep, there he goes. There, there, there goes the ship. <laughs> there goes us all. <laughs> are we dead? Uh, what so, happens? So you go into hyperspace. Where's I think this is where we all die. <laughs> Has it been 30 seconds? No, because it's only been two rounds. That's only 12 seconds. That's only 12 seconds. <laughs> so You're being dragged through hyperspace. So so how does this work in your universe? How the fuck does he not die? So as the... I got... Don't worry. So you're the first to go. <laughs> so I blow, right? <laughs> you blow. Well, actually you get dragged over <laughs> away into the... So, you know how hyperspace it has that blue world? Right. He gets That's dragged into living. that, and you see his body kind of start to disintegrate. GPD, the... never give this man a badge. Oh, God. <laughs> and as his body is disintegrating into the blue world of the hyperspace, like the exterior of the hyperspace, your body's disintegrating. The bomb that's attached to you blows up as you're disintegrating. Mm. <laughs> God, dear I <laughs> and Witness then, me! And... Shiny and chrome! And obviously you're no longer holding... One of the detonators. <laughs> so the yeah, other one goes off. <laughs> you gotta shit at this. <laughs> so, the other one, ship. so the other one goes off on the ship. I gotta see how, how much damage detonators do again. Lots. Even if it doesn't do enough damage to structurally destroy the ship, it'll do enough to it'll break at its least, hull. It'll at least cause it to leave hyperspace. So we're definitely having part two is what I'm hearing from this adventure. I don't know. I think all the characters are going to be dead. Well, even if they don't, I don't know. <laughs> Let's look at the consequences here. We drag the guy and another ship to hyperspace. The guy obviously died. The other ship's getting knocked out of hyperspace because of a detonation of thermal uh, grenade. Thermal nukes. Destiny point. 
retroactively turn him into thermal nukes. Oh, that was <laughs> bullshit. Oh. Destiny point. It was a dud. You can't, you can't destiny reaction to destiny, Dan. Don't you know? That's that? it. There's a go. There goes my. Like tur- I tell you what. On your turn, you do something creative with your destiny. Point. <laughs> there goes our destiny pool. We cast each other out just now. We're good. Let's see. It was a dud. Well, How the <laughs> fuck did you carry something like that on your back? <laughs> dud. Uh, since the two of you have you. Okay, so the ship is, ship is still fine. Barely. Oh, thank God. Barely. Uh, did we get knocked out of hyperspace? Well, first let's see the reaction to this one getting dragged into hyperspace. Uh, so because you're being dragged into it, you're kind of being pushed into the same disintegration that killed your friend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we do. Your parts keep blowing so up. You see your, <laughs> so you see your ship begins to disintegrate. Oh, shit. So, do you want to react and run over to a escape pod and yes. live? Yes. Alright. Go ahead and use your escape pod. Seriously, your partners have a habit of blowing up. So, <laughs> well, this one disintegrated and then blew up. <laughs> True. So, you go into an escape pod and you make your way out. Uh, I'm going to see if he... Higher or low, Dan? Let's go high. Hey, nat 20. So the ship leaves hyperspace. Guess what? Just what? above Narshida. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Asen gets on and he's like, he sees you guys and so you get a call and Asen's like, oh, hey, you guys made it. We're going to send a ship over there to pick so up. So how the- long has it been that all this has been happening? <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go pick up the cargo now. And so you see a couple of ships coming. Do you want to try to stop them, knowing that there's one more detonator on your ship? Do you know? Is that metagaming? Yeah, he knows. Yeah, he knows. I know. Knows. I know. Because the, their ship has sensors to know when things are attached. Yeah, I don't know. So as you're about to call to warn them not to come, you see Ro taking a <laughs> escape pod with the spice. Motherfucker. Oh my god. And he. Oh, ha. Wait. Ha! Hello. Hi, hello. No, hold on, hold on. I got a thing here. Okay, well, go from ahead. From the dead. From the death. From the void. Destiny point. You can't, you're Destiny dead. Destiny point. You're a 30 d- second timer bomb. Did not end up on the ship's hull, it ended up on the escape pod. <laughs> <laughs> Well, as... I can't even respond to that. I'm going to it. <laughs> as a GM, not... I can. Uh, no! Oh. GM uses dark side. Yep. You got it in for this captain guy. <laughs> it's Burt Reynolds. Of course I do. It's <laughs> Burt Reynolds. So, high or low if, to see if he makes it out before the bomb goes off. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why I never play charismatic characters. Higher low to see if he makes it before the bomb goes off. Yeah, let's go two for two. Let's go I'm high. Gonna, let's go for horseshoes. <laughs> Come on, Caleb. That's high. Yes. He made it. So he gets on the escape pod and goes, Poof! and you're just like, you motherfucker. Boom! No, I don't, I don't finish it. Yeah, you mother. Boom! And you see it shoot off in the distance and you see it go. <laughs> so, yeah, you. And in my universe. Anyway. We just got, like, wrecked by Burt Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> Burt Reynolds made all the money. Well, no, he made some of the money. Yeah, he made 30. He made well, 30. made a dirty cop. <laughs> some dirty money. Yeah. <laughs> he made 30 grand. I don't know how well it's helping me now that I'm in an escape pod in the middle of space. <laughs> well, at least you can report back to your chief saying your other partner blew up. <laughs> well, your ship is... I want to kind of jump over to him since he's still alive real quick. Wrap it up there. Yeah. And I think a part two might be necessary. I might have to make some new characters. <laughs> Flash forward, you make it back, and you're getting dissed out by the chiefs. Like, Deputy, the mayor's all over my ass! I'm not really blowing up chips in the street of the city! What do you have to do for yourself? <laughs> I'm gonna slip it. was good idea. I was a rookie. You just Bro. make some fly noises. He's not a fly. Deputy! He's not a fly. So, your escape pod is actually over a planet. And it crashes into that planet. It's a water world, though. Yeah, Kamino. You know, Kamino. Um, yeah, I thought so. So you land on Kamino. So you open this to see all this rain and all that, and you're like, oh, hmm, I guess I landed somewhere. Because this is an uncharted planet. I guess we'll leave you there for next time. Sounds good. I think next time should, you should be starting trying to get away off. Yeah. 
Or made with every single Kyoshin on that planet. <laughs> no, don't do that. Because yeah. <laughs> I mean, the Kamen Cam Owens are still living there. I mean, that's where they're from, so... Well, this is a millennium before the show. So yeah, way before. They're so. probably not in the clones yet. They're not in the clones yet, <laughs> no, but they, they probably even, still have ships and they stuff. Might, they might not even be developed yet, honestly. They probably are. You sure the species developed that fast? Yeah. Let's not reset because we don't have time. <laughs> I, I think about technology as much as species so anyways, rivers, it arguably it only takes like yeah. half, a, half a millennium to, to advance yeah. to advance to a specific point. I mean, just look at how what happened to us when we just found gunpowder. What? Yep, uh, that'll be interesting. Hey everyone, thank you for checking out the video. If you enjoyed what you just saw, be sure to give us a like, comment, and subscribe. If you don't want to miss any of our content, be sure to hit the bell icon where you will be notified anytime we upload a video. Also, if you wish to watch RPG Workshop live, you can follow Studio Bastion on Twitch. There, you can also enjoy his gameplay live streams and other podcasts that are in production. Also, if you like what we're doing here at Escape Reality Films, be sure to check out our Patreon and support us, and get some cool rewards in return.